So why are volcanoes significant? You might be thinking to yourself, well, they're significant because they're hazardous. We need to know about them because they're harmful. Um, and that's true, but that's not the only reason. All right, so you are right in thinking that volcanoes are hazardous. They're very harmful. They have a socioeconomic impact. That means that not only can they kill people and animals and vegetation and ecosystems, um, they can also uh, hurt, uh, disrupt our health, right, by putting fumes and other gases into the air. They can destroy our structures, our roads, our buildings, our infrastructure. So this is what we normally think about when we think about the impact of volcanoes. However, there's also good impacts from volcanoes. Um, volcanoes give us a lot of good economic impacts. That is because volcanoes produce really nutrient-rich soils. Um, so people who live near a volcano often have really great agriculture because the soils there are so nutritious and rich. Volcanoes can also produce really important ore deposits that we can mine, um, like zinc, copper, iron, silver, gold, sulfur. A lot of those minerals and ore deposits come from volcanoes. Um, they're also a source of geothermal power. Right? We get heat from volcanoes that we can use to produce energy and heat our homes. And they also produce a lot of important industrial building materials, right? So volcanoes are actually pretty good in some ways, as long as they're not actively erupting. <laughs> um, they also have a great scientific importance. They allow us um, to understand the interaction between Earth's atmospheres and atmosphere and oceans. They also allow us to understand Earth's interior and allow us to understand uh, the plate tectonic theory of Earth. Right? They are a peek into Earth's processes, so that's why we study them. We study them by actually going down into the volcano, also by standing very far away, being safe, and just collecting data with sensors. So I said the volcanoes can help us understand the plate tectonic theory. Um, that One example of that is the Ring of Fire. There is a ring of volcanoes all the way around the Pacific Plate, the Pacific Ocean, um, and that's one of the ways we figured out that there were tectonic plates on Earth because of this ring of fire, the ring of volcanoes around the Pacific tectonic plate. 